I agree. And I think uh, along with that, there's sometimes a tendency to get a piece of music and, and think that we have to play everything that's there. We can, we can take out the bad parts. Yeah and not be afraid to change that accompaniment right in that verse yeah. and it's a perfectly good piece of music and so I, I sometimes I hear things and I think they were we could have just changed that yeah. you know you know it didn't have to but you're right about uh, wisdom and numbers or wisdom and other opinions uh, right. good music people looking at those pieces and 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 getting it but we do that all the time here yeah. and say what do you think about this phrase and well we could change that yes. and and so by consensus we come to a good piece of right. music sources as I said you could trust everything they put out yeah. um, the, the thing that comes to mind would be uh, like John Peterson for instance John Peterson um, uh, tremendous hymn and gospel songwriter I mean we sing his songs all the time, heaven came down in glory, filled my soul, uh, you know, isn't the love of Jesus something wonderful? Uh, how can it be? All these great hymns and, and gospel songs. But um, it would, there was a time when everything John Peterson wrote would be appropriate. Now you probably couldn't sing much of John Peterson's music at all since 1980 maybe perhaps.